Oh yeah, we're finally back. What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel, or welcome to the channel if you're new here. Today, finally, Shadow of the Earth Tree has dropped, and you already know, based off all those series and videos I did long ago, <laughs> I loved Elden Ring and made a lot of videos on it. And honestly, without wasting any more time, let's just get right into this, man. Oh, oh, you weren't here before. Hello. Ah, were you guided here by kindly Nicola? I am Leda. I was guided by Faith along his honorable path. Touch the withered arm, and you too will be transported to the realm of shadow where Nicola the kind now dwells. My compatriots are there already. If you can find them, they are certain to lend you aid. Ha! <laughs> well, I won't need it, because I don't use summons. Actually, you have any extra dialogue? Come now. Touch the withered arm and travel to the realm of shadow. I will not be far behind. May we meet again. Well, if you're not going to be far behind, I don't think there should be any problem. Oh, oh, here we go. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, shoot. We get some brand new cutscenes too? I mean, obviously, but like transportation? Ah, would have been cool if they did something like Dark Souls, where it's like kind of like lean over to touch it and then you just like teleport through it that would have been cool but man i don't even need to see what the world looks like i can just tell this is already about to look hold on Ooh, hoo, hoo. yo nah hold on hold on i gotta do something for this look at this dude Dude, from Soften, they're just amazing scenery, man. They know how to make a world look amazing, man. Like, I don't even know what to actually say for this. Other than it looks amazing. Look at this tree. Also, I see that fire giant over there. Dude. All right, I, I got to turn the HUD back on, but dude. Where do I even go first? I don't even have a map. I'm about to have a map. Do we? I don't even know why I was gonna ask, but yeah, we still get torrent. So before we really get into this, uh, I created an entirely. Yo, whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold on, hold on, hold on! Hey, hey, hey! Calm down, calm down. We can do this civilly, or not. Ooh, huh? But 240 in that. Yo, chill. Oh, okay, you don't got that much health. Ow! Hold on. Now you think you got cool arts? Check this out. Hmm. Hmm. That would teach you for trying to ambush me. How many runes for that? Only 15, <laughs> only 1500. All right. So like I was saying before that, I created an entirely new character, completed the game in like eight hours with this same armor. <laughs> Ooh, gravesite plane. That makes sense. But this time, instead of wielding two giant swords, I am now wielding two smaller swords that do pretty good damage. I prepped this character specifically for Shadow of the Erd Tree. I didn't even, um actually like complete the game. I beat Radagon and Elden Beast, but I've left America there just in case if there happens to be an ending gained from completing Shadow of the Erd Tree. But just so we're clear, this character is level 150. I always stop most of my new characters at level 150 so that way I'm at the base cap. Though, if y'all want to see a new game plus seven run on Shadow of the Erd Tree, we'll go ahead and hit that like button real quick and also subscribe so that way I know you actually do want to see it. <laughs> I might be a little too OP for the starting area. Dude, the fact that there's more weapons and armor in here, is that a bird? It just entices me to search more now because I don't want to miss anything. <gasps> Yo, it's the goobers. Yo, look at them. What the, are they? I don't want to attack it, but at the same time, I want to know what happens. <gasps> oh no, okay, they're like the jellyfish. Ah, ah, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. I was just testing. What's this? First boss, Western Nameless Mausoleum. What do we got? Black Jail Knight. Okay. Ah, oh shoot, yo! It's it's like that one guy in uh, Dark Souls 2 by the sand pit. Oh wait, no, it literally is like him. He's got a crap ton of health. I assume we're gonna get his crossbow, but that sword would also be pretty cool. Ah, his sword got priority. I might be a little too OP for the start. Holy, okay. All right, okay, good to know. This guy's tough. I thought I was too strong, but turns out I am not strong enough. What does the map look like? Oh my. Well, then again, our, I would say that that's small, but no, this, holy crap. Dude, there's a castle over here. And then there's like a, a quarry over here? 
Dude, there's a lot. Like, I know they said it was gonna be big, but I didn't think it was gonna be this big. Then again, I shouldn't have expected anything less from FromSoft. After all, they are known for making um, not only amazing games, but pretty good DLCs. Oh! Oh! Whoa! whoa. Okay. All right. I will try one more time before I have to use the contingency plan. I also decided to play a little bit fair by uh, not having ashes on my weapons. Just so that way I don't absolutely destroy everything. Mm, that did nothing. What it? What, what is the do? Alright, contingency plan. I'm not losing to this guy again. So the contingency plan is using giant swords. I leveled these up just in case if I got stuck somewhere in the DLC and needed to absolutely pummel these things. Or enemies. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there we go. Yeah, not so tough now, are you? Please don't hurt me. Dude, that's so fast! Oh, almost hit list run, but I got him! I got him! 70k for that? Oh, we got his stuff. We got all of his stuff. Great Sword of Solitude, Helm of Solitude. So, the Solitude armor. Yo, could I wear that? How heavy is that? Yo, I can use it! Oh, I thought I would... Solitary Moon Slash. Oh, is that... There's no way that's all it does, right? It's got to do just a little bit more than that. Hold on. Really? There it is. Oh, that's sick. I might have to get some somber stones and level that up. But for now, let's keep going. And how about that armor? Oh, it's... It's definitely heavy. 10.3... <clears throat> what? How does it look, though? It's a bit robust, but it looks pretty cool. I think this was supposed to be our first challenge, but if it doesn't come up with a big health bar, then maybe not. But I'm still gonna fight it anyways. If I even can, because it doesn't look like you can actually... Yo? Yo! Okay. One thing to note. We can't get super close. Okay. 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 Yep. I think we're gonna need a giant weapon for this. Wait, maybe not. Hold on. Can I attack it? Oh my god, I can attack it. I'm assuming you gotta break, like, the ropes or something. I'm dead. Yo! No! <clears throat> okay. Got it. Good to know. I will not be fighting him. Not right now. Okay, that was a pretty good sound. There's the crescent moon looking thing. I want to interact with that first. Oh wait, there's an item. What's this? I... God, I should have read that. Carved words, coalesce. I abandoned here the first of the flesh of my body. Okay. Oh, hello. I didn't even notice you were here. Oh wait, you're a different person. Guided here by kindly Nicola. I am Freya. I once fought alongside General Radan. In hmm. battle, you can be sure I'll hold my own. Well, I will not be summoning you because I... <laughs> I play summonless, I'm sorry. But, I mean, at least you made the journey here, right? Did you speak to our Dara little friend? Who? If you've yet to do so, have him give you a map of the Cross's whereabouts. You'll find more of them dotted about these lands. They are Mikola the Kind's footprints. These? Okay. Good to know. Oh, they appear on the map, too. Nice. Okay, let me sit down and see if I can do something with these, because... Oh, there it is. Shadow Realm Blessing. Consume Scatter Tree Fragments to bolster your Scatter Tree Blessing. The Scatter Tree Blessing bolsters the recipient's abilities to deal and negate damage, but has no influence outside the Shadow of Realm. So, we can do more damage and receive less damage? Okay, I'm down with that. Yeah. Where are we going, by the way? Okay, we're going up to the castle. Nice. <laughs> this is definitely not going to go poorly. I've got a feeling that I'm going to go up to this gate and it's going to say that I can't go in there. Also another fragment. What do we got? Carved words, coalesce. Okay, it's the same thing. Oh, okay, I need two. You know what? Now that I think about it, I wonder if these scatter tree blessings, obviously it's probably going to make the game a little bit easier, but like what would it be without them? So for the new game plus seven playthrough, if I get around to doing that after this is done, I will absolutely not use these scatter tree blessings. A door that actually opens? We are breaching new territory. Territory that I'm kind of scared of already. No. 
A scorpion? Okay, never mind. No reason to be scared. Oh, wow. They're really paying homage to, like, Dark Souls 2 and Bloodborne with these hanging, uh, scorpions. Scorpion liver. Didn't even know they had those. Also, wait, did it say what this place was called? Because I was not reading. I was not paying attention. Oh, there it is. Bellurat Tower Settlement. Yo! Why don't I ever expect these things? Not another capital. Yo, whoa, 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 what is that? Magic. Oh, hello. How tanky. Yep, pretty tanky. All right. But they're... Oh, hello. Fire Knight Quileen? Hey, you're just a spirit invader. Yeah, never mind. You got some health on you. What the? F ah, I got priority. Which means you're down. Stay down. Stay down. Crusade Insignia raises attack power after defeating an enemy. So that's like really good if you're in a horde of enemies. Shriek of Sorrow. Yo, we got a yelling Ashabor? Yoink. Storeroom key. Now we about to rob the place? What? Oh! Ow, ow. How could I, why didn't I expect them to? Wow, that is, I don't know why I didn't expect them to not make the birds more annoying than they already were. Oh, is this a boss room? Nope, but there is a giant scorpion. Oh, this, this one's bigger than the other ones. Like this is quite literally a giant scorpion. Nothing that way. So there has to be something this way. Yes, elevator. Nice. All right. Okay, down here then. It's gotta be. Oh no. Oh no. What are you? What? What are you? Oh. Uh, ah. No. 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 What? 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 No. You can't tell me that there isn't a boss. Yeah. There's even a summoning sign. There's a boss through that door. All right. Let's do it. Oh. Oh snap. It's it's the thing. Oh, shoot. Oh, horn-decked beast from higher sphere delivered. Take root inside the tower sculpted keepers. And perched within, we beg of thee, rise. Oh. Shoot, here we go. Oh no. Here we go. That is that is just Divine Beast Dancing Lion. Yo! Oof. Oh, we do good damage. Hold on. Yo! Yo. Ow. What was that? Whoa! 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 attacks what was that dude it just did a twisty what do i even say to that that was just extremely unexpected it it, it torpedoed itself at me dude i wanted my runes dude i i don't i oh i only know panic roll what is going on i'm over here thinking yeah we're about to be fine i'm about to go through all these bosses but no no, I'm not. Forget the runes. I need to just fight this thing straight on. One, two. Okay. All right, I got it. I got it. Never mind. 
I keep forgetting that that's a thing, man. I just, it's, I just don't expect bosses to start spewing stuff from their mouth. Uh, no? How about no? 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 What the f- Like, there's, there's literally nothing more I could say, but holy- Whoa! How many different moves? I gotta try the big swords. I gotta see what this thing is really made of. There's no way this thing manages to out- DPS me anymore, especially with these swords. If I still manage to get destroyed even using these swords, I don't know how far I'm gonna be able to get into this. One, two, and then spew. Okay, apparently I just can't dodge it. All right, lightning. Okay, so when he shoots that beam, be that's not what I thought he was gonna do. He's got different, dude. What is going on? You know what? I have the grace here. I'm gonna go explore a little bit more before I keep trying to defeat this thing because there's no way I can currently beat this right now because that thing is doing a whole lot of damage. So much to explore, man. So much. Is that a living thing? That's a dragon. That's definitely a dragon. Let's go fight it. Yeah, it's a dragon. Oh my. Ghost flame dragon. I do no damage to it. Down it goes. Oh no, come on, jump over. Come on, come on. Mm. Yeah. Oh wow, that's a good amount of damage. Oh, that's a good amount of damage too. Oh, I thought, what? Yo, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, okay. I don't know why I didn't expect any like new attacks from the dragon. Whoa, it did a stomp. And then flame. I get that other dragons did that, but they did like a small little, like puddle sized amount of uh, affliction. I think the only two that did it though were the decaying dragon and Borealis. But those two were tame compared to whatever that was. Chill with that, you ain't gonna hit me. Let's go. I realize I'm gonna have to use these in order to get through this. For some reason, I thought this was gonna be one of those items where it was gonna be like, people are definitely gonna be like, oh, no, 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 don't use that, don't use that. But no, I think we can all be in agreement that based on the damage numbers we're seeing, I should be using this. Castle Ensis. Okay. These damage numbers are minuscule, man. Am I even supposed to be here yet? The talk didn't even go down in one hit. These are level 25 weapons. Okay, he went down in mostly one hit, so I guess it's not that bad. Maybe it's just that it was a troll. Those guys usually have a lot of health. I'm totally not coping right now. Castle cross message. Let me guess, I have to go grab a certain weapon or item to even get to these doors. Message left by Needle Knight Lita, addressed to kindred spirits who also pursue Mikolas' trail. Kind Mikolas seeks the tower sealed by shadow and the gate of divinity found there. If we are to reach him, we must burn the tree that seals the path. Oh, it's always about burning trees in this game, huh? And for that, we require a flame. I'm not gonna attack unless you're hostile. Well, sorry, man. Oh, there's a down route. Hey, man, thanks for pointing me in the right direction. Oh, there's a lot of you. Uh-uh, nope, I'm gone, goodbye. Ooh, waterfall. Don't tell me that this can push me. Oh, we gotta do some platforming. All right, we're good. Oh, come on. This is like a really obvious spot where you'd put something. Or not. Okay, always with the corners. And I think we're on the other side of the gate. And to that I say, we are opening the gate. Are you guys conversing? I'll let you guys continue your conversation. No need to pay any mind to me. I'm just going... I'm, I'm just passing through, dude. Chill out. Alright, cool. We're back to this. This is so fun. Dude, that decaying, like, castle and the- Yo! Oh, not another one of you! Nope, I don't want to deal with another Moongrum. I- I don't like Moongrum. I have an extreme distaste for Moongrum. Raylana's cameo. It, it is literally a- Oh, his sword is bigger this time. Still mad! Where did he come from? Roll, 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 roll. Go, go. Ow! Grace. Ha, ah, there's one in there. Oh no, I can only tell this is about to end greatly. Hello. Raylana, Twin Moon Knight. Okay. Oh! Oh, okay. Got a very evasive style. What? Yo! Come on, 
<sighs> okay, decent damage. All right, I thought I could duck under that. <sighs> All right, you got a quick attack. Ow. Ow. What in the fast am I fighting? Look at this. Two swords and just, what do I even do? Nah, hold on. I ain't losing again. I'm winning this time. Moon Veil? Mm. Okay, nope. Not a Melania situation. Cannot use Lion's Claw to... Okay. Dude, is there even a stagger point for this boss? Like, can I posture break at all? What is this? Dude, I, I can't beat any of the bosses, man. They've all got such a high stat. Like, first I can't do damage to the lion, so I go to a different boss to see if I can beat it. But turns out, that boss is even harder. I fought Melania last night, and thought that was difficult. Why is everything seemingly harder than Melania in this game? In this DLC specifically? I'm not mad, I'm just taken aback by how difficult some of these bosses are. FromSoft did not sleep on the difficulty with these guys. Like, holy! <sighs> there we go! <sighs> Mm. So they do posture break. Listen, we can talk about this. Oh. Like, I knew it was coming, but I just didn't know how it was going to happen. What can possibly be, be beyond some of these bosses? I'm just so curious. Because if I can't win with a normal weapon, then I'll use a different weapon. <laughs> Dude, still no stagger damage. Whoa. I'm doing even worse with the bigger weapons, man. Okay. Miss. And that. Whoa. I'm gonna try the lion again. That. Oh. Yeah. Dude, I spent an hour and 10 minutes and straight up nothing. I have not beat one of the major bosses yet. I beat a regular random knight that's out in the middle of nowhere. What am I supposed to do? Okay, I got two, so that's helpful. What's this? Legendary item? Blessing of America. Completely restores HP and heals all ailments. I'm pretty sure, based off the shape of this, this already existed. I think this was in Dark Souls 2, but I don't remember what the item was. Oh my god, I just realized it's a dragon. It is a dragon with a hole carved in its chest. Dude, that's a big dragon too. Might be the size of the elder dragon. There might be a chance that this could just be... Like, these first two bosses are just really tough. And that maybe there's other bosses that aren't so very difficult. <laughs> but who am I kidding? Everything seems to be difficult, even that dragon. Yo, man, what's going on? What's up? Upon your heart. Mark my words. You too shall know fear. Okay. We are gonna leave that guy alone because I want nothing to do with that. What's in here? Oh? Ah. The very center of the lands between. All manners of death wash up here, only to be suppressed. Look at this place, dude. So much to it but so little that I can actually get to. I didn't realize it's all placed in like an organized manner. Like you got the decayed woods right here, got the big castle by the tree over there, got the nice lush woods over there, and whatever this castle is over here. And then obviously this strange blue and red area over here. It's all neatly organized, not even like, not all squished together. It's good looking, man. They did really well on the design of this map. Just wish I could kill the bosses on the map. Lady Letter spoke of you, another tarnished, guided here by Mikola the Kind. My name is Teolia. I too am tarnished, and here on kindly Mikola the Count. So, well, here's to new beginnings, I suppose. Yeah. Um, I'm sorry. Well, I'm not much good at anything at all. I'm as weak as a kitten and thick as two planks. I've always been this way since the very day I was born. I'm afraid the only thing I'm proficient in is, is poison. Hmm. Oh, yeah, actually proficient in poison. Nice. 
Yes. Four. So how much up is the damage now? 715. It's not bad. It's still not enough. It's too much lightning. There we go. Finally, man. Mm. Mm. Take time to heal. Take time to heal. What? I'm sorry. Did the electricity bounce off the wall? Ice? He's got poor frost stomp? What? There was no indication of that having range. This boss is straight up a mystery. There's no telling what this thing is gonna do. I, dude, where, where, where's the boss? I can't see it because the camera's flinging around. Ooh. Chill out, Radagon, dang. Whoa, what form are we in now? What, oh, we're in wind form. Hold on, so it's random? I thought it was a, whoa. Oh no, charge attack? What is it doing? Whoa, tornado, okay. That's not that bad. Oh my god! But this thing is just so difficult. How did that even hit me? This run's already shocked. He's already done so much damage to me. Yeah, whatever game. Whatever. Oh, so cool. The, wh why can it fly? Hmm. Hmm. Wind phase. Come on! Yes! Yes! Remembrance of the Dancing Lion. Ooh, and a legendary. Divine Beast Head. Yes! 120k for that. Only? Dude, a, a base dragon. I think... Flying Dragon Ag Heal gives you the exact same amount. The one, or whichever one it is at the bridge in Kaled. I was about to level up. <laughs> nope. Dude, what? Okay, let me just go over that fight for a second. So I figured out kind of how to do that in the very last stage of it. <laughs> so first phase is possibly the hardest phase to deal with because he's all over the place sporadic. But if you have a weapon that can stagger him, it you can do it if you hit him enough times. So just keep hitting in su rapid succession. Then, once he goes to lightning phase, I wanna say that if you just stay on him in lightning phase, he's really easy. Just, you know, try to stay away from the lightning. When he gets to wind phase, that is his easiest phase. Cause he doesn't have anything that can really hurt you until he gets up in the sky or starts charging it up. And by then you'll know it's coming. And then frost phase, I got nothing for you. Just try to dodge his stomps, that's all. You're kidding. I gotta go somewhere else, don't I? Message left by Needle Knight Letta, addressed to kindred spirits who also pursue Mikolish Trail. The Gate of Divinity lies- is this not just the same thing? Okay, no, it's different. The Gate of Divinity lies and the tower is sealed by shadow. That is surely where kind Mikolish is headed. We are no Empyreans, but we must locate the path that will lead us here. Lead us there. I will follow the crosses east. So I fought this lion- okay. Sealed and obscured in shadow. At least I didn't, like, I'm assuming that this is gonna break open at some point. So, before I end off the video, I'm gonna give this fight one more shot. Maybe five more shots, actually. But I'm gonna give it a shot. Because I do kind of want those weapons. This is the wrong one. Also, I'm thinking about it now. If you're running mage, good luck. <laughs> you are gonna get hit by these bosses so hard. It's unimaginable. One, two, and three. Ow! I didn't even dodge it. 
Nope, panic roll, panic roll, just panic roll. If all else fails, panic roll! Sometimes you don't even have to panic roll, you can just run away. I lied, because just that extreme lunge. Dude, not even Millennia had that type of lunge. Who is this boss, man? Uh-oh, 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 nope, nope. But that is pretty cool. Okay, Elden Beast, calm down! Dang! Wait. Alright, that's, yeah. I'm realizing how tough- Alright, that's cool, you just fired those off instantly. Wow! Now, I'm gonna give it one more shot. This might go on for like an hour 50 in terms of recording time, but as long as it stays under two, I think we're good. I forgot, if I dodge forward, there's a higher probability that I can survive that. Wow, that's dumb. The tracking on that is stupid. So tired of this boss already. I hate it. This is literally the new Melania. Those are the same swords as mine. Why do I take the damage so hard, man? Dude, it's crazy. She takes no stagger damage, but I take every little bit of stagger damage possible. Why does my character suck so badly? I'll just, I will switch armor, but I'm not changing the helmet. I have slightly more poise than I had before. So I should, in theory, be able to take more hits than before. Oh, cool. Use your moon veil. That's awesome. Oh, cool. I have to dodge those. Love that, dude. Oh, cool. Moon veil again. Awesome. Yep, there's the unblockables, or the un- like, what am I supposed to do there, man? Of course, man. Yep, can't dodge it. You have to literally dodge beforehand, and then somehow dodge on time. Oh, and that one you have to dodge. Oh, and then there comes the second hit. Like, dude, what, what am I supposed to do here? Why? Why? I was so happy going into this too. I was like, yeah, this is gonna be fun. It's not. It straight up isn't fun. I all fun has been lost. I hate it. Whoa. Huh? Whoa. Okay, so that's undodgeable. Okay, I don't think it's dodgeable. I think what it is is you can jump over it. <sighs> Dude, run! What is my character doing? My character is selling! The fact that that even happened, my character straight up said, Oh, oh, let me walk backwards as if there isn't an extremely tough boss in front of us. Oh, wow. Turns all the way up and then death and then death and then death again and then death again again. Oh my god. Pressure, 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 pressure. Mm. Oh wow, because that can kill me. I want to forget this boss. I want to beat it and move on and forget about it. I will take its swords and throw them in the garbage. This run is already shocked. I can feel it. Yep. People over here using bleed and magic and crazy other crap on this. Meanwhile, I'm here using two dumb stupid swords at max level that do literally no damage. Oh wow, yep. Delayed attack. Again? No, 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 don't do that to me, man. Come on, man. No, 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 Oh, but then it decides, yup, and then it decides to do that. Let's throw in a little movie as not seen before. Oh, that's not the... Oh, now you want to do it. Yeah, cool. Whoa! That missed! Do you see that? It went that way! Why did that hit me?
my stubbornness will not let me leave until I beat this. I don't want to feel like this boss actually beat me out of the game. I need to win. I don't care. I have to win. I'll give it like two, three more attempts, man. I don't want to play this anymore. I'm genuinely already tired of it. Honestly, I'm just gonna have to face tank hits, man. I don't think I can win if I don't. Nope, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I don't want to play. What is that? I'm done. I don't want to play. Nope. Nope. This DLC has lost everything from me. It is a straight up 0 out of 10 rating. Trash. And we're back. Alright, so, yeah, I definitely got a little bit mad earlier. <laughs> However, uh, after taking a break, I feel much better. I feel like I can beat this boss now, which has been the case for the bosses that make me quit. <laughs> it's rare that a boss makes me actually quit. I need to change that helmet. Yeah, this, that's gonna make everything better. There have been very few bosses that actually managed to make me quit, and those are usually the bosses that I find to be the hardest, which is funny because the, the only few bosses that actually ever really made me quit, I think were Leonine and, um, what are their names? Um, wow. Ornstein and Smoke. I think after that, I actually just uh, stubbornly beat every boss that I've ever fought. This one, though, this one is a whole nother tier of difficulty that I didn't even think was possible. Like, we've got Melania, and then we've got this boss. But I have learned a little bit through actually watching someone fight her, and it's a very graceful moveset is what I'm realizing. Meaning, there's a rhythm to it. And if you're slightly off in the rhythm, then you will fail. So paying attention is absolutely key on this fight. And obviously there's going to be those swift little hits there that are going to get in, but, you know, for the most part, this boss is not nearly as bad as I initially thought. She's just very fast. Like, very, very fast. There's the rhythm break, can't break. You break that rhythm, it's over. <sighs> nice. <sighs> However, her second phase, that's where it gets real tough. I should have dodged into it. However, I've noticed she's kind of like Artorius in a way. Such as that she she doesn't like you healing. Meaning when you go for a heal, it will be very hard to keep your- Like, you have to keep your distance, is I guess what I'm trying to say here. Keep your distance and wait for an opening, if need be. But there's absolutely a rhythm to it. Holy crap. One, two, three. Wait it out, wait it out, wait it out. Wait it out, wait it out, wait it out. 
Heal. Heal again. And that's the fight. Yeah! There we go. First try back. Ah, it feels good to learn the boss, man. You know what? Everything I said before, like, before this, scrub it. That might actually be my new favorite fight. Genuinely, and I genuinely mean that. This might be my new favorite fight. Because there's just such a, and, and I mean this, there's such a beautiful rhythmic flow to this fight. And if you lose that flow, it becomes a whole lot harder. Whoa, alright, I... okay. That music came out of nowhere, I wasn't expecting that. Hello again. Did you meet my compatriot? They're quite the congregation. From places as far and wide as you can imagine. Doubtless it have all come to blows at first glance. Were it not for the charm kindly Mikula put upon us, this is what allows us to serve together. The work of a living god. Anything else? We're all utterly captivated by kindly Mikula. It is what binds us together. But yeah, genuinely that's actually a really fun fight. And I, I really feel like there isn't much more I can say about it other than it being actually fun once you learn it. But it, again, it really isn't that bad. I thought I was really gonna have to switch up my entire loadout. Who are you? Another. What is your mask? Then, as that woman would surely say, we are in our purposes well alive. But understand, your kind are not forgiven. The Earth Tree is my people's enemy. By Marika long betrayed, set aflame. I believe Mikela's apologies when he says our delivery will come. But never will I see your kind as worthy. What's wrong with being tarnished, man? Aren't you also t You know what? Sorry, I- You say something like that, you're gonna get me a little ticked off, man. You see what I just did? How did you even get through here? And yet, my oath, I cannot overlook. If Mikola it is whom you would seek, then comrade, allow me to give you this. It'll show you where crosses can be found. Oh. My bad. Um... Thanks. Nicola has said as much himself. He says, "Oh, ah, skip the dialogue. God dang it." Be painful. Will Seer clean the Earth Three's wanton sin? The truth of his claim can be found at each cross. It is evident enough to warrant my belief. Go Anything else? This shaken tree of Umbra. In that forsaken place, blood must spill. The blood of your fellows. The Earth Three faithful. By the way, I also forgot to mention when I got off. A few things I did. Uh, you know, obviously I took a break, took a breather, I got food, I ate, dude, I needed to eat. Like, I think that was one of the things that was making me angry, man, I didn't have food in my stomach. Um, and on top of that, I actually decided to watch someone else, and from there I observed the entire boss's moveset, and that was helpful. Observing it from a point of perspective where I'm not the one fighting makes it much easier to learn these things. Oh, I was also gonna say, while I was watching the stream, I kind of realized that this DLC is like a more cracked out version of Prepare to Die. And let me explain. The Lion Dancer is basically the harder version of the uh, Sanctuary Guardian. What was that? What is that? What is this? Somewhere a Great Rune has broken? And so too has a powerful charm. Did you break one of my... No way, right? Wait, I don't have one. <laughs> Never mind. So, Raylan is like Artorias. You have to complete her fight to get to the next fairy shadow keep. So that means there's probably going to be boss equivalents to what I believe are Calamite, which is probably going to be the dragon that they showed us in the uh, trailer. And there's also probably going to be a boss equivalent to Manus, which I wouldn't be surprised if that's what we're about to fight. Because this looks like a boss arena. Oh, you can't tell me that this isn't a boss arena. Oh, I think I found it. Well, let me do this real quick. Golden Hippopotamus. Yo, 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 chill, 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 chill. Oh! What? Yo, chill. Okay. I'm not great with beasts. That's, that's kind of where you get me. How would you go about getting back? And how much of the map did I just discover? What is this? 
Okay, that's got to be the dragon. That has to be the dragon. That was like a bunch of worms, dude. Imagine if we have to fight like a giant worm. That'd be pretty cool, actually. Nope, I want my runes. I don't care if they're pretty much useless. Ah! Well, I'm dead. That's fun. That guy has a... Dude, he's knee healing. Please be a legendary item with some... Uh-uh, no, no, no. Ow, outer God Heirloom! Wait, real Outer God Heirloom? That's probably got some lore to it. Whoa! Golden sheep. Wow, they really are golden sheep. I thought these were just the lightning sheep, but no, they're actually gold sheep. That's cool. There's a bear over there. Bet this guy's like a miniature boss fight, right? No! Not yet. No! No! I'm not even dead! Oh, there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, alright. That's cool. Ooh. Blessed Blue Dew Talisman. Blue Dew. Oh, hey, it's the starting point. Oh? Oathseeker Knight's, uh, armor. Oh, it's just like the, um... Did I miss it? Oh, there it is. Yeah, it's a darker version of the, uh, Sorcerer Knight. I forgot what it's... Cuckoo Knight. No, that's the wrong one. That's still the wrong one. What is it called? Glintstone Knight? What's through here? A boss fight! Let's go! It's probably not a boss fight, right? You wouldn't do that to me, would you? Thou shalt not oh. evade the flame of Mesma. You don't want to do this, man. Alright, you want to do this. Ow. Alright, man. Calm down. I will disrespect you in front of all these people watching. Don't do this right now, man. Oh, that's kind of cheap. Come on, man. Just give up already. How could this be? Forsake me not. Oh shoot. Flame skewer and prayer room key. Wait, did I just like full kill him? I guess that was an enemy. That dude's over there hyping himself up like he's meant to be the biggest NPC that there is. Like, dude, who are you? You just appeared out of nowhere talking about Mesmer. We already don't like Mesmer, so. You know, be careful what you say, because you just might not be spared. I guess we have no other choice but to go off to the right, because I don't want to fight that hippo right now. I'm going to go fight that hippo right now. <sighs> this hippo is going to be pretty hard to fight, man. I can feel it. Like, based off everything that's happened so far, it's not easy. But it isn't downright t uh, super hard. I, I don't know what to say there. All right, man. Also, this thing's gotta have a huge posture bar. Never mind. Holy crap. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh. What was that, like three hits? Not terrible. Ow. Not three hits. Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa! That's kinda cool, actually. Anyways. Dang, does everything have a second phase? Or at least like some form of change? Cause that's pretty cool. A thorned hippo. I mean, as if hippos weren't already dangerous, we just had to go and give it thorns. Whoa. He just hit me with that quill attack. Sonic the Hedgehog style. Mm. Mm. Okay, so it's four hits to the knock. Got it. Not that it matters, because this next hit is death. Okay. That was way easier than I thought. Why did I think that was hard? Aspects of the Crucible thorns. That was a Crucible? Okay, bet. Dude, I bet that looks so cool, but like... I don't have anything to use that with. Listen, guys, we don't have to do it this way, man. Calm down, calm down. Oh, wait, you guys are just knights. <laughs> Ow! Hey, it's the flaming boats. It's got flaming boats out here. What are you? You're gonna die, that's what it is. Okay. Ooh. Oh, you can farm him for sure, dude. I want that sword. If it can do that fiery, like, light up thing... Gimme it. He didn't give me it. Oh? A grace... Is that a giant... You know what that is? I'm pretty sure that's... Oh, there's a lot of them. 
Oh, there's a lot of things here. Oh, wow. I'm pretty sure that's a ancestor spirit, but it's huge. It's not like the small ones or like regular sized ones, I guess. What is following me? Ooh. No way. Right? Oh, that's cool. Real Dark Souls 1 moment there. Mm. Oh, it's just like the Duke's archives all over again. I don't know where I am. Oh, another note. Probably don't need to read it, but I mean, sure. Same thing, right? Oh. Carve words coalesce. I abandoned here my arm dextral. Probably more to this place now that I look at it. Oh yeah, there's more up. Can you even go all the way up there? Dude, this place expands on forever. This really is the Duke's archives. Oh, wow. Message left by Sir Ansback. Address to kindred spirits who also pursue Mikolish Trail. It would seem that the people of, of the keep have flooded the holy quarter that leads onward to the Shadu Tree, bearing access. However, there is no route that leads there from this storehouse. Perhaps there is another way to reach the holy quarters from somewhere else in this keep. So something tells me that that's telling me that when I go up here, there's no entry. Dude, leave me alone. I don't want to fight you. <gasps> come on, come on, Grace. Yes. Ow. Stop it, dude. I'm trying to talk to the NPC. Calm down. Yo, what you looking for? Oh. Hello. I'm afraid I'm busy. A curse upon my lack of foresight. I should have asked Anne's back to impart his knowledge when I had the chance. I'm afraid I'm busy. Truly. I should have asked Anne's Oh! Idea. Idea just popped up in my head. What if we go and find this guy? Just out of curiosity, maybe this guy might be able to help us. You the guy? You must be the tarnished. I am Anne's Yes! Formerly in service to Lord Moog, but now, like you, another soul guided by kindly Mikola. I'm hardly the steady hand I once was. My fighting days are far behind me. Dude's gotta be older than Godfrey, then. Because yes, that guy's still kicking. Where. Kindly Mikola has discarded his great wound. Oh. Okay. Aging faculties has been lifted, and follies better left forgotten haunt me once again. Once... In an attempt to free Lord Moog from his enchantment, I challenged Tender Mikola, only to have my own heart rather artfully stolen. I knew not how weak I was. I believed that with sufficient mastery, even an Empyrean would be within reach of my blade. I could not have been more mistaken. Mikola the Kind is a monster. Ooh. Pure and radiant. He wields love to shrive clean the hearts of men. See, that makes sense. That's what I think a lot of people probably think, right? Mikola's like, oh, he's, he's hyped up to be this kind, caring, Empyrean. But it sounds a little too good to be true. I'm pretty sure he's gonna, like, ask us to do something in request. And then we're gonna do it, and we're gonna end up fighting him. Because we think we can trust him, but turns out he's actually the big bad of this entire thing. Righteous Am I crazy to say that? Mikola the kind makes my blood run cold. I am loath to admit it. But even at this very instant, I wish to run very far away indeed. I need your help with something. Tarn I you weren't helpful. Hello there. Together, we work. Even if kind Mikola's light is broken. So? I find things. Many things. <sighs> I don't know what to do. Our mother abandoned her brood. She did not love us. We are her children. What should we do? Must we be sad forever? Ooh. Oh, come on. Honestly, man, put it behind you. Maybe that's kindly Mikola's love. Love for all the unloved. Love to banish the pain. Whatever, man. Whatever. All right, you know what? Whatever, man. Whew. Running start. Nice. They wouldn't be fashioned into, like, a stair shape for no re- they, They're literally fashioned into a stair shape for no reason. Again, it just doesn't feel right that those would be fashioned in such a shape that you wouldn't be able to climb it. 
You know what I'm saying? Imagine if you're not supposed to do this and I'm just guessing the complete wrong thing and I managed to make it. Ah, come on. Oh? I'm a legend. I am legend. Got it. Oh, okay. Never mind. There's just a invisible wall. So, yeah, that's cool. Thanks, game, for giving me false hope. Okay, straight up. Alright, man. See, now they just gone and done the dumbest things ever. Like, really? Why are we camping? Oh, yeah, we're in the sewer system. Oh, boy. You're joking. I came all the way down here for a stupid painting. Man, I'm over here hoping for a new route. Maybe a way to go. But no, a painting. It's always a painting. Oh, right here. Show I am so dumb. What items can we get? Probably the armor, right? Yep. Cool. And then new remembrances. What is that? Raises potency of storms. I don't have anything of that, though. Divine Beast Frost Stomp. Okay, cool. There it is. It's free? 16 dex, 16 faith, and 16 int. I don't have the stats for this. I could lose health, but I'm not willing to do that. Not right now. Moon and fire stance. It's so cool. Oh, Raylana's twin moons. Incarnate two moons and repeatedly strike the ground. 72 int? Dude, I will be back for some of that stuff, though. Definitely something down there, though. An underground section? Shattered stone talisman. Uh, I mean, well, the only place I can go realistically now is down. So I kind of guess we just have to... Come on, man. See, if I angle it just right, maybe, just maybe. Wow, I actually survived that. I was fully expecting to die. But no, I did it. I survived. Oh, no, 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 no. Nope, nope, nope. Item, please. Item, 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 item. Grab the item. Really? Golden arcs? Really? Are you telling me I came all the way down here for an incantation that I'm never going to use? Am I gonna emerge from a well? Yup, climbed out of a well. That's pretty cool, I like that. Oh wait, we're a, a layer lower. Okay. Yo, jars. Oh, bony butchering knife. It's funny, cause that's literally the exact same butchering knife that you get from that one person. Oh, hello. All right, good to know. We're just proficient in butchering knives. Oh, up to this manor? Okay, hold on, wait. We'll go up to the manor and then I'll end the part off. Okay. Holy Jesus, that actually scared me. What the? Oh, okay. Cathedral of Manus M Medir? It's not Medir. It's a cathedral. It's not a manor. And it's probably a boss fight, too, considering whatever's in that room looks hostile. Oh, wait. Never mind. I This is from the trailer. Hold on. Wait. Interaction. Then. Oh, he, su he used the summon and the mimic. That's pretty funny. I kind of want both the summons to die. Anyways. Well, we don't often receive visitors. I am Emir. Welcome to Manus Meta. Meta. It's a pleasure to have you. In lands so forsaken as these, chance encounters are precious indeed. Seeing that we have convened here on this day, allow me to mark the occasion with a modest offering. Whole laden necklace and ruins map. Okay. Map to old ruins received. Check inventory. A simple old map faded and dirty acquired from Count Ymir. I think I said that wrong. He literally just said his name. High priest. Indicates location of a hollowed ruin. I only wish to be of service. Well, funny thing is, that looks pretty familiar. The map I gave you charts the site of a hallowed ruin. It is said that after sounding the hanging bell there, Ooh? one's fate will be guided by the star. I only wish to be of service, to help those who fight for their purpose. I'm not mistaken, am I? I can see it in your eyes. You are a fighter. Are you not? Is something the matter? I've given you a map to the hall. Oh, I suppose you expect a lesson of me. Oh, okay. You? Excellent. Skip a bit of those. I know the feeling. Those with purpose are nothing if not ravenous for power, for truth. Hey. You have all the same things that I've seen before. Okay. Anyways. Do mind your feet around the church. You wouldn't want to hurt the little boy. What? Hold on, what? Um. 
Anyways, all right, that's gonna conclude the first part, which I did a lot, and I have a lot of editing to do, which is not gonna be fun. <laughs> anyways, if you have enjoyed, and you do wanna see more, even though I'm gonna do more anyways, then you already know what to do. Hit that like button, and also subscribe, and on top of that, hit the bell notification icon so I can get notified when I post new videos. Thanks for watching, everybody. I gotta go. Stay cool. Peace out, people.